Greetings gentlemen and ladies, old school game snob here in today's video. Uh, Roger, I'm gonna answer your question because I think it would be easier to just show you. I was gonna type, I was just checking the comments, I was gonna type out a reply, but you know what? I'll just show you. It'll be easy. How to transfer bone weights to clothing. If you followed my tutorial on how to add bum bones, bum bones to your DAS 3D model, uh, you'll probably want to do that for your clothing as well so you can have jiggly physics on your clothing and this is actually very easy to do so here's my model with my uh, my uh, left and right bum bone that you would have uh, also have in your you would also have in your model from following the tutorial there uh, so here's what you're going to need to do for, so go ahead first and just find a piece of clothing that um, oh, this will be fine all right so we're going to want to find the item that we're going to want to transfer to now in this case it is the the shorts that I want to transfer the bone structure to right so uh, very easy all you're going to need to do is you go to edit uh, object transfer utility uh, and then select the item you want to transfer from this is the source item in this case the Genesis 8 female has the bum bone uh, just leave all that as it is the the destination item is going to be the casual shorts all right, so if you show the advanced options, these are the things that are going to get transferred over. Things like uh, weight maps. Uh, things like, uh, uh, well, basically basically everything that we need to, the bum bones and, and that sort of stuff. So I'm just going to go ahead and click accept on that. And once I do that, you will see that if I open up my hip and pelvis and all that sort of stuff, you can see that the bum bones have been transferred over to the piece of clothing. Uh, in exactly the same. You know what? I'm going to actually switch to joint editor so you guys can see that. So as you can see, there's the bum bones attached to the piece of clothing, the very same as the bum bones are attached to the Genesis model. So I can actually just uh, hide the Genesis model, and as you can see, the bum bones are still there attached to the clothing item. It's just all copied over. Uh, if you take a look at the weight assignment, that is also copied over. Just uh, everything's good to go. Let me just show you really quick here the weight weight brush weight brush map um, parameters where do I go here I kind of forget there we go tool settings that's it general weights uh, what was it what was it left bum right bum I kind of forget how to get there now <laughs> uh, oh there we go left bum right bum general weights all right so we've got the weight map that has also been transferred over and like I say if you did if you did my video uh, you'll know about adding the weight uh, weight to the bum and basically yeah that just transfers over with the bum bone and everything else and you can go ahead and you can export that a, a single piece of clothing into Unreal and when you do that it should basically just work you will attach it to your Unreal model in very much the same way that you attach any piece of clothing with the uh, set master pose component I have a video on that if you don't know how to do it and the jiggly physics that you have assigned to your DAS uh, physics asset will just work. It'll just work. So, okay, that's it. 